Back you, baby. When you look at 50 Cent right now mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and all stuff that 50's accomplished, we all from Southside together. Yeah. But you're the first person to ever sign him to a record deal. Yeah. Power the dollar was under your watch. What's the feeling you get when you look at him and what he's become? Can I tell you something? I'm very happy to see a guy do everything he said he was going to do. From the first meeting, when I first, I first met him, he came, you know, a lot of people know the story. He rapped for me in front of the barbershop when guy up brew and all of that stuff. And he, he thought, said that you yeah. didn't pay him any attention. He thought I wasn't paying attention because I was on the phone, because the phone, it was the truth. Yeah. The phone rang and it was Matola. I pick up the phone, but Mark was in the car with me and Mark is like into it. And I'm hearing him. I can hear. I, I can talk to 10 people and still hear that this motherfucker's yeah. nice, right? So by the time the phone call, 50 was like, yo, all right, man, whatever, you know. Uh, yeah, he, he, he snatched his tape yeah, back he from was, all right, man, whatever, I'm out. Like, you know, just you know, pop the CD, all right, man, whatever, you know. Mm. And he walked off, right? Mm. And then, like, two days later, I reached out to him, and I said, listen, I want you to take a ride with me up to Bearsville. You know, that's basically Woodstock. That's where he used to go create all, like, if, yeah. you, if, you, if you was recording in Bearsville, you was a high priority. Yeah, we would go way up there, track masses, all of us. Mm. Um, and, um, and everybody was up there. Nori was up. I got footage. I just sent Tone some footage of him, Jungle, which is Nas's brother, Nori, all those guys playing back, L.E.S., Gowdy, all of the track master dudes playing basketball. We turned a big vocal booth. We put a basketball court in there. Everybody's playing basketball. But... 50, 50, 50 <laughs> was the type of dude, right? That whole ride, let's say a two and a half hour ride, he said he was gonna rap, focus on it for a little while, but then he's gonna like leave that over here, not abandon it, but it's not gonna be, he said he's gonna shift to making movies, television. From the beginning, he said that. that. From that car ride, from that car ride, mm -hmm. you know? And to see him actually do that is amazing. You know what I'm saying? And again, look at all of the things that coulda, woulda, shoulda stopped him from doing that. So he's just more determined. You know, when 50 starts bullying people, it's all a marketing ploy. I mean, some people he's dead serious. Yeah. And the other thing about it, he's <laughs> really about it. He's not one of the guys that say, you know, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do that. Come on, we all know he's 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 really about that shit. Mm -hmm. Right? But he is. All of and that everybody is, oh, knows I'm aware. That. That's yeah. the funny part about it. Everybody be like, yo, but but you know, he's he's really about the bullshit though. Yeah, he, like, he wanna, he is. wanna get down to it. He, yeah, yeah, he's really yeah, yeah. You know and, by, and by himself. He used to be by himself. Absolutely. So uh. but his focus, this is not, he didn't stumble into this. This is all calculated. He makes records for his projects, mm -hmm. you know? Like, what's one of the dopest parts about watching Power? The intro, yes. the, the song, they Same say thing this with is BMF. the big town, yeah. BMF, all of that. Racing you know, Canaan. He said, yeah. I'm not gonna do, he told me once, I'm not gonna chase the pop crossover. Me, He's like, I do hip hop, um, the shit that people don't be playing on the radio all the time. He says, somebody gotta do it. Like, Cool G Rap back in the day made the decision, yo, somebody gotta do this. You know, so I'm doing it. I represent that part of hip hop. Mm. And he's, his break comes from everything else, you know? So he's in a real comfortable place right now, and I'm happy about that. When he did um, How to Rob, like, <laughs> like what was going through your mind? Oh, no, for me, I was like, oh, boy, we, we got to clean up a whole lot after this. Really? Mariah Carey was so mad. She was so mad that she wanted him dropped from the fucking label. Because there's a line there that said, Mariah Carey, so, so, so put your shit on the floor. You ain't with Tommy no more, you know? So, like, we had to change that line. <laughs> I like, didn't know that y'all changed that. Oh, I remember we had, that. No, band. there's yeah. a version where it's like, Mariah Carey, they had to blur, uh, blur it out. But we don't know that you ain't with Tommy no more. That was the... Yeah. Like, Why do you think yeah. so many people got so offended by it knowing that it was... A creative piece. Come on, man. The way that shit came. Listen to. Here's the thing, though, because in the industry, people are gonna know. But when public opinion sees it, yeah. and how that record dropped, how Flex debuted it, how it hit the radio, and that song worked, we we're like, yo, who is this guy? 
When it hit the mixtapes, we was like, whoa. So when you know he when he did that, you know he was being managed by Def Squad. Mm -hmm. Eric Sermon was my next door neighbor at the time yeah. on, Long, on Long Island. And when I signed him, when I signed 50 to Sony, you know, with me and him, the way we did it, I, I didn't have a production company because I was a Sony executive. Yeah. So what we the way we did the deal is there was 18 points, right? I took five points and gave 50 to 13 points, 13 points. So he got you better know? than 12. 12 is a dollar and eight cents. So he, right. got, he got more than the average. You gave right. him one point more I than I got average. five points, he got 13. points. Okay. And that's how the original deal was structured. I, I still have the paperwork, right? And um, when we did that, um, you know, like he jumped in the studio with uh, track masters right away. That's what that whole, mm -hmm. whole thing was about. But um. Damn, I forgot my fucking thought. Like, I got fucking on something. I forgot what we were saying. Well, you're talking about 50 and, um, probably the, oh, the um, record. Why was people so uh, oh, upset at, at right, the I'm creative back. side? I'm of back, it. everybody. Uh, no, nah, you know, but what it was was, you know, so Eric Sermon and Def Squad, you know, Bernard Alexander. Well, Bernard. Yeah, <laughs> Bernard. Bernard. I mm -hmm. felt like they would be better to manage him, you know, because he definitely needed a day to day. Yeah. person and somebody in that space. So you gave and him over to them, just called them up and was like, yo, this is what y'all right need to do? Right next door. I walked next door, knocked on the door, <laughs> like, yo. Manage him. I, I need this, you know, I'm going to introduce you. 50, 50 had to love the situation, which he did at the time. Um, so they did that. I believe they did that record in Eric's house because they had a, he had a nice studio in his house. You know, and that record was created so fast that before I can even say, maybe you shouldn't or maybe you whatever. It was on already. It was already on the radio because Bernard and those guys went to Flex mm -hmm. and, and whatever. Mm -hmm. It was already happened. That's a relationship. It, it already happened, you know? And it is as, a, as solid as Jay-Z is of a dude, and of an um, artist himself, it struck a nerve because he definitely gave him a little mention, you know? What yeah. the fuck is 50 I'm cent? I'm about a dollar. What the fuck is 50 cent? cent. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, hey, he got his attention. And that's really what, from day one, I just felt like 50 is, again, an authentic dude. Jay is authentic, too. Everybody look at Jay and his success. He's really one of those niggas that's really about the shit, too. Yeah. You understand? Everybody, you know, and that's why it's authenticity. Mm -hmm.